Hello, my name is Michael P. Jones, and this is my story about the 90-day tithe challenge. It all started back in probably 2011, uh, 2012, but I had to find a church to go to in Nashville, Tennessee. And at this point in life, it was a very dark point in my life, and I went to church, and on this particular Sunday, the preacher, of course, was talking about tithing. And of course, like everybody else, my thought process was, oh my gosh, I don't have enough money to tithe. And at that point in time in my life, I had $40 to my name. I looked up and I said, God, you know, I don't have a lot, but I do have $40, so I'll split it with you. Life just started getting better and better. We ended up moving to, to uh, Jacksonville and we started attending Beach Church. They brought up this 90-day tithe challenge, and I thought to myself, you know, I, I always give, but I never commit to a certain amount. And so that day, it just fell on my heart to commit to a certain amount, so I did, and I think this was 2019. I look back now, and sometimes I feel like I had been robbing God. But it's not that I robbed him of the money, it's I robbed him of, of the chance to give others blessings or to, to, to give me a blessing. After I started the 90 day challenge, we never really missed a beat. It's been my experience uh, that through generosity with my time or through my giving, that God has allowed me to grow in other areas of my life to where I do want to reach out and help others. And I've also found that by doing that, I kind of get up out of myself um, and quit worrying about the day-to-day -day things. And I'm able to reach out and, and help those in need. Be faithful in the tithing. Be faithful with a generous heart, whether that be with money, whether that be with your talents, your time in helping or serving at the church. But I can tell you this, God is waiting, waiting to bless you and to bless others with whatever it is you have to give.